Zachary, your two huge goals for the Lakers tonight. How are you feeling right now? Um, I'm, I'm feeling pretty happy, but the job's not done. Uh, that was a tough Six Nations team to get through, and it was a battle the whole series, but um, if, we, if we go out to BC and we lay an egg out there and don't come back with what we're expecting to get, then no one's going to be happy. No one's going to be happy that we won this series, so our job's not finished, but definitely happy to take next steps in this process. A lot of young defenders on this team, we've talked about it before, but you didn't play like you were young at this point. Uh, I mean, I've got I've got guys like Robert Hope, Ian Lord, who are just insanely smart defensemen talking me through everything, mentoring me, and they're just great communicators on the floor. So um, it definitely helps having those guys out there, and it's a, it's a full team effort. There's not one guy that's doing it, and we're a tight-knit group back there. So And again, playing in front of the two best goalies in the league. I might be. Sorry, I was going to say, the, uh, the other young defenders too, I mean, Jake and, and Matt and uh, Eric Schul, like guys are really stepping up into, into bigger roles, but it never looks like it's too much for them. Yeah, I mean, uh, we're just trying to bring energy and we're going to do it, whatever the coaches tell us, whatever the other guys tell us. Um, so we're just trying not to think about being young dudes on this team because everyone's so personable and everyone's so friendly. There's no egos on this team. So it's easy to feel like you're a part of it and feel like you're, you're contributing to the team. Zach, you were, you were part of that team last year that wasn't able to put them away. What was different this year? Um, I think we just got complacent last year. We went up three zip and we thought, oh, we've got four chances at this thing. Um, so who cares if we drop the first one, maybe even drop the second one, we'll get the third or the fourth. But with this year, we didn't want to put anything up, up to chance. So um, it was nice to be able to get this one in five. Would have been nicer if we got it in four, but I mean, whatever. We got, we got to win. At home this way. Yeah, yeah, so it's special, especially in front of the best fans. That, that are in the game of the cross. So, yeah. Awesome. Well, you, you you were with them. Uh, forgive me. Were you a rookie two years ago? Or? I was a uh, call up. You were a call up. Okay. Yeah. Um, but you won it in Six Nations. What, how, how was a different experience at it winning here? Um, I mean, just here in the crowd, like you get goosebumps. The the final buzzer is ticking down. You got three thousand close to 4,000 people in the, in the arena just screaming, all getting so excited for the same thing. And it just, it feels like uh, like the whole town's behind us, like we know they always have been. So um, for us to be able to win it at home, it's huge. And we, we got to get the job done and bring back the trophy. Kind of exciting to be a big factor in the deciding game. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm not thinking about it while I'm playing, but I'm just trying to work as hard as I can. I happen to get a few bounces tonight, and then I finish my chances. What are your thoughts on going out and playing in the Man Cup out west? Just stick to our game. Um, don't get too caught up in whatever the other team's doing. Just try to stick to our game plan and execute our system. And uh, when we do that, we're great. We, I just heard a stat. We're 19-4 to in the third period in this series, which is huge, just showing how, how our defense just locks down teams when we, when we play our systems. Perfect. Thank you. Congratulations. Awesome.